No warm up, no nothing. They just going to action. All right. Marcelo Rojas and Ernesto Dominguez. All right, we got action. 9-9 nine, nine race. It should be something worth sweating. You're watching the Mez West State Tour. Stop number nine. Bull Shooters. Phoenix, Arizona. Ernesto Dominguez versus Marcelo Rojas. It's your man, Ra Hanna. Solo for the day. But bringing you the best in West Coast pool action. This is how we do it. to break. Wow, a good break. Yeah, this looks like a fast game. If that three passes by that eight, we're looking at a 310 here. And it's accessible. Easy shot on the one. Joey Barrera and Eric Young, table 24. Joey Barrera, Eric Young, table 24. You can race to seven. Come get your rack. Solo shot here. He says, forget that, I'll play the 3 7. And there you go. Four in the top corner. Aggressive shot. Well struck ball. Well, we didn't see a three ten. But I guarantee you we'll see a 810. Oh, this guy likes to spin the ball a lot. tell but I'm like is he playing a billiard or he's playing a combination he played the billiard good shot so Aroha gets on the board first I'd like to thank the official cloth sponsor of the Mez West State Tour Andy Billiard Cloth you can check him out at andybilliardcloth.com Andy Cloth.
<laughs> All right, and Marcelo Rojas should break. Nice pop on that. The four goes. Nine sits in the hole. And a shot on the one. He might have came a little bit too far. He gets the bounce. Cue ball is going to be working. He says, I'll just take the angle and shoot the 310. Table 30, can you please get Ben Marvina and Oz Avila? Oz Avila and Ben Marvina on table 30. Even race to seven, please get your rack. Well struck ball. And Mr. Rojas leads two to zero. <laughs> we have a pencil ready for Steve and Demar. Steve. <laughs> nice break by Ernesto. Tough shot on the one, but I still might play the 110, play safe. Let's see what Nesto does. He's always so crafty. Let's call him the 10. So I don't know if he's gonna stiff stiff the one and, and bring the one there. Play the one two rails to make the ten. Tough shot here. Marcel is going to play the 10 also. Miguel Colonado and Bo Renigan, table 31. Miguel and Bo, table 31. Bo goes to 9, Miguel goes to 7. Come get your rack. He had a bit of a two way in there built in. And that's still with a kick here, either way. Nice little safety here coming up. That's going to be a little treetop here over the five ball looking at Pop a good shot on it too. That was tough. 
six nine tied up. <laughs> six nine is tied up. Yeah. <laughs> Our main man, Bill's father, is in the booth cracking jokes. <laughs> All right. And so Rojas is figuring out this six nine. That's that's what he's thinking about. He says, should I try to get on a six nine or do I play the three ten? What do I do here? Because he's not getting out with those balls tied up. We have a basket of fives right in the bar, basket of Killed that ball. Outside juice. Now looking to get on this six. Stroke. <laughs> baby. Get the cheese. I'm good he hit that ball. This guy has to be a billiards player. Cause he stands straight up a little bit. And those those shots he just played like that shot he just played right there. A reverse, reverse draw, but on a perfect line to break the balls up on the right side. speed I think well if he just cuts this ball in he's a champ but um play safe here he's crossing I don't know about this one because even if you cross it where are you going to shoot this nine ball <laughs> Where are you gonna shoot this nine ball? Yeah, see, yeah, that was he, he. He gave that up. He gave that up right there. I, that decision was not uh, the smartest one in the book for him. So right now, Ernesto has to play shape on this nine ball or play the nine ten. How about that? How about that for an old man? Get the cash with that one. Get the cash with that one. <laughs> Get the cash with that one. Ernesto just came right out the bats and said, forget a combo. I'm going to play shape on this nine. He got perfect. Well, Marcelo had a good opportunity there to make it 3-0. Ernesto says, you know, I still got a lot of life left in my pool. And we got two to one action. Great shot. I'd like to thank our sponsor, Aramith Balls and Simonis Cloth along with CSI, Q Sports International. Thank you for supporting the Mets West State Tour. This is your man Ron Hanna out of Bullshooters in Phoenix, Arizona. 
Ernesto Dominguez trailing Marcelo Rojas by a score of two to one. Okay, Mr. Rojas to break. Nice pop on that break. Ah, he doesn't get anything to fall. Vanessa can freeze him behind the 7-8. Or hook him on the 6 ball, bank the one down table. He has a bunch of choices here. There you go, right behind the six. It's a tough hit. Well, no, yeah, it is tough. He has to come under the two, two rails. Uh, attention goal shooters, we have another birthday in the house. It is Javier's 21st birthday. So happy birthday, Javier. Uh, he's just going to, yeah, smart play. He's going to break the balls up because he said, uh, you know, if I leave them balls there, Nestle's going to get out. So with a nice bump right there. Looking for that three in the side. So goes right to work. My guess is that he. Ah, I think Ernesto's going to play the, the, the 6 9, but I'm not sure because he can get position anywhere. What a wizard. He's going to punch this ball in the face and slide up table with that super spin. Insane. He actually overspun that ball. Now, unless the seven, seven caroms off the eight in the corner. And then I'll look for Nesto to play safe here. Put that to the rail and, and freeze him on that ball. He did play my shot. Oh, man. Ernesto Dominguez showing why he still got it. What a shot that was. All right, Nestle needs two rails back to the nine ball unless he's going to go inside and get some float down table. Yeah. And he's a little bit, a little bit out of line. Good. Yeah, he, he can spin this in. But he's going to have to let the rock go a little bit. Up and down, downtown. Watch this side. He says, I have a bus pass. <laughs> That's a Dominguez showing why he's still one of the most dangerous guys on the West Coast. Very good shot right there. He's looking to, to knock this game up at 2 2. The young gun versus the. Oh man, and there we go. 
Table 15, Samson and Derek, Table 15, even race to seven from Missouri. Thank you for our sponsor, Fast and Loose Designs. Check them out at fastandloosedesigns.com. Chris Santana, Fast and Loose. Ernesto Dominguez ties the score 2-2. Two -two. Says, you can't leave me that, kid. I'm still here. Beautiful shooting. So Ernesto makes quick work of that rack. <laughs> Man. Ernesto got loose on that rack. He got loose and got out. He might bump himself right into shape. Wow. Gets behind at five. And now we're going to see. Ruben, your food is ready to mark Ruben. It's Marcelo's turn. I'm looking for a push here. Marcelo thinking of where to push because if he leaves Ernesto an angle, he can play that 8-6. Yep. He knows. He don't want to make it up. Ernesto says, okay, I can cut this in off the 7 if I need to. Vanessa just trying to keep the pressure on his young gun. I think Marcel is looking at playing the 8-6 here. Plays a nice safety here. And that's why has a one rail kick in his side. And if he does, or he jumps it, he's going to play it in the side because the cue ball. Oh, he's going to play it in the corner. He's a mass A. What a hit. And he didn't leave him anyway. So now, Marcel is definitely going to play safe here. Looks like he's banking the one to the six and putting the cue ball. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna say this guy definitely looks like a billiard player. You should have, if you could have saw his bridge close up, his uh, finger wasn't even closed on the stick. It's like a, uh, it's like a, um, oh uh, man, what I'm trying to say, an amateur, like an amateur's bridge. When you tell them to make a bridge and they don't close their index finger around the queue. Good hit by Ernesto. But he leaves Marcelo straight in. Marcelo is still going to have to negotiate this 8-6 to 4-7. This is, this is a good rack to determine your ability here. the rail and out back cut to two in 
Play the three seven or play the three off the rail off the seven. He's looking to go back and forth. I think if he just pops this in and goes back and forth, he can just play that three seven. He said, never mind. He just held that line. But once again, he's putting himself in a little bit of trouble here. This looks like tap the seven and scratch. Unless if he hits it in the face or if he draws out of it. watch this guy the more I know he's a billiards player or his main game is billiards it's not pool shot and he manufactured a shot on the five ball which is the most important part nice swings back two rails a little bit of rail here <laughs> scratching his head because he know he left himself straight but he has some rail here that if he utilize that billiard nose and a little backhand English he can pop that in and spin right off how's that for touch ladies and gentlemen Tough shot coming up. You don't want to turn this over to Ernesto right now. And he drilled that ball. That's a clean shot. All right, three two action. Marcel having a discussion on whose whose break it was. It's supposed to be Ernesto's break. But I think that they cross breaks up somewhere. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh man, he broke well and he's gonna leave. Oh boy. Ball in hand for Ernesto. The balls are all open, available, and runnable. Table reassignment, Chris Lola and Scott Frost. Table 18, Chris and Scott. Scott goes to nine, Chris goes to seven. Come get your Alright, Anesso was on the two. Five. This is, uh, Anesso should be out here. No tough shots here at all. A little out of line on that six ball. I guess Ernesto likes to use the rail to hold up. Vanessa says, perfect. Three to three. Just like that. Get a hand shoot. Best three piece jump cue on the market. Give them a call at 254 498 1941 or check them out at handshootcustomcues.com. That's www.handshootcustomcues.com. Fall. Open and available. Another runnable table, but with another difficult lead-off shot here. Depends on how Nesto's feeling. He can cut this in with inside English to try to hold it up, or he just plays safe. Whatever Pops does is a teachable moment, so let's find out. Cut it in with inside. Now we're going to see a little bit of draw. Maybe he draws back and plays a 310. Think so. So says, go ahead and play that 10 ball. Yeah, Nesto played a little bit of a two-way there. I, I think it got away from him, though. I think he can see the whole three ball. Yeah, bad speed and a four available. Marcelo should be able to get this rack. Get a little long on this ball. It seems like 
they're having a problem with the speed, both players. So I think whoever figures that out first is going to win. I think you just, if there's not, if the scratch isn't on, you just back cut this four ball because the five's right in the hole. And, but if you want to go to safety side, then you bank the four towards the eight and try to freeze the rock under the ten. But this guy's shooting. I think he's going to give this up. Stroke that ball. He answered any questions. Left itself long again. This is going to be a problem. He's gonna scratch too. That's gonna hurt. And that's what's gonna go ahead and uh, make the move here. And here we go. Easy for Ernesto. Just like that, Ernesto Dominguez on top, 4-3. And it's Ernesto's break. I thank the official cue of the Mez West State Tour, Mez Cues. You can check them out at mezcue.com. Make your way down to any of the tour stops and ask to try the demo cue. We have all six shafts available for you to try. Ernesto Dominguez leads Marcelo Rojas, four to three. You're watching stop number nine, Mez West State Tour. Marcelo Ross has his work cut out for him here. He's going to pocket the one by the ten and try to fade up by the three. Strong shot. Ball's gonna hold. 
Boga. <laughs> Good job, Ernesto. So with a little pop here, stop, drop, two rails off that eight, and he's on the ten. Right in line. Beautiful hit by Ernesto to move up five, three. Yeah, it's all good. It's all good. All right, Nesso up 5-3. I'd like to thank Tony Rodriguez of REMAX Gold Coast Realtors from Ventura, California. Tony Rodriguez for all your realty needs. Nice break by Ernesto, the six falls. The two's gonna fall and the one's gonna hang up. And Ernesto has a runnable table here again. Also looking for the extension to make sure that he does not give away any shots here. Ernesto goes with the long extension. This looks like a Pop Dominguez invention. I don't think he sold out anything. But if he can see the edge, he can spin this in. He left himself dicey, but he wired that 710. It's going to 
Then go to the rail first here. A little spin music. And he hung it up. Oh boy, if Ernesto gets to that side where he's standing right there, he's gonna make that ball. Ernesto seemed like he went a little too far in this shot. <laughs> I'm still standing. All right. Pop's looking to do some magic here. And he jacks him up on the floor. I saw it look like a one rail kick here. Nestle freezes him to the back of the floor. What a good shot that was. <laughs> Jose Gonzalez, Dave Martinow, table 17. Jose and Dave, table 17. You're going to race to Come get your rack. Marcelo makes the table tough, leaving Ernesto a 4 9 instead of a the four and the open. But the next one might just go right ahead and break these balls out. Almost a beautiful shot. Onesso still in control here. Looking to see could he bank this ball and save him. He's just gonna thin it and put him down here by the seven. This is going to be interesting. That's going to bounce out. And also is looking to keep Marcelo off balance. So has an open look on the seven. This up the rail. He wants to hold it for shape, though.
here we go. Right in the side to get on this 10 ball. He should be good. And he misses it and leaves on that throw the eight ball. This is going to be trouble. He didn't leave my hanger, but. And Esso hits a beautiful bank, but puts the 10 ball. If Ernesto banks this in the corner, I'm going to be sick. If he banks in the corner, wow. Mm, that, was, that was close. But, um... He gave it up. And Mr. Rojas gets an easy game. 5-4. like to thank the official rack sponsor of the Men's West State Tour, the Turtle Rack. Available in groups of two. The Turtle Rack www.meswestatetour.com All right, Marcelo the break. Balls wanted to fall. He leaves the nest out of fire starter right on the one. The two is available in the side, and it's going to be trouble. And here we go. Nice stop shot position on this three ball, and pops is off to the races. So Dominguez making quick work of this rack. A little slide over. Man, what a great stroke that was. And I still put on that ball. But speed pops drills that ball and moves ahead 6-4 we'd like to thank sponsor West State Beer Supply best products at the best prices if you have a game room you're looking for shuffleboard pool tables sit down video games Arcade games, anything you need, 
for your game room. Check them out at West State Beer Supply. Give them a call and tell them that we sent you here at the Mets West State Tour. Thank you. Nesto really whacked that break. Yeah. Nothing fell, but he hit it really strong. Little two rail safety here coming up. The only problem is he's gonna leave the one. Nice shot by Pops. Plays that one off the seven and gets perfect on a two ball. Who's winning so far right here? Ernesto. Okay. Yeah. That's what I would have bet on. Putting the work on him. Guy plays good though, Marcelo. Yes, but Ernesto plays good. I call him the legend killer just because he tries to like hell when he's got the toughies. <laughs> he does that more than anybody I know. Yes, he does. You're right. He's like me, actually. I really, I, I got feet off playing a better player than I do playing yeah, I my see. speed or even. I see. Yeah, that's a good one. And so looking to go two rails here back to the six. And really put the pressure on it, on Marcelo. Leading 6-4, looking to go ahead 7-4. Slides right up top. Nesto's speed is looking uh, pretty formidable right now. Seems like he has his table clocked. And here we go. Nesto gets a little bit out of the line. He needs four rail shape here. Nesto says, I'm going to go inside English and just spin one. I don't need to go four. He's, he's feeling froggy. <laughs> and Nesto said, I, I just want to get this match over, and I'm just going to do My the least. Will move the very least. <laughs> the <laughs> least, exactly. And Nesto goes, going to go ahead and move ahead, seven to four. Nesto Dominguez handling business. I'd like to thank the official tip sponsor of the Mets West State Tour, Zan Tips. Check them out at zantips.com or contact Oscar Dominguez. Zan Tips. I'll get some scores around the room real quick. Peter Lorca, Ray Robles tied it to a piece. Tony Allen on the hill against Rick Armburst. And I, Tony Allen defeats Rick Armburst. Samson Mayanko and Derek Coamora tied at 4-4. Ed Gonzalez, 8-5 over Spencer Laddick. Jose Gonzalez and Dave Martin now tied at two apiece. Scott Frost and Chris Lolick. Chris Lolick up 3-2. Joey Barreria up 7-5 over Eric Young. And uh, Ed Gonzalez defeats Spencer Laddick.
Looking for a nice safety here if he bumps that four. And gets right behind it. And leaves Ernesto, you know, in trouble. But Ernesto has been uh, capitalizing on these situations and coming out lovely. Ernesto's going to the Mass A. And just missed it. But he pushes that forward almost to the rail, so. Here we go. Marcello looking for an angle. Table Sam, Rick Arthurs, Table 14, Bill and Rick, Table 14, even rings to 7. Come get your rack. Clean hit. So right now. He's looking from that to the four ball. He needs to hit this ball really clean. Get a good angle. Just like that. Well struck ball. Mr. Rojas looking to get out here. Nothing in the way. Bobby Emmons, Manny Lovano, table 16, Manny and Bobby Emmons, table 16. Bobby goes to 8, Manny goes to 7. Come get your rack. Nice shot by Mr. Rojas. Looking to make it 7-5 right here. Just like that, 7-5 with Ernesto to break in. Break in and get on the hill. And Ernesto continues to break exceptionally well. No shot on the one here. Expect to see some kind of uh, chicanery here. Ernesto replaced that ball behind the ball to put him in trouble. jumping good jump except he's gonna leave Vanessa straight in on the one that's tough you know <laughs> you have a tough shot to begin with 
and your opponent executes and leaves itself a hanger. Yeah, so looking for the angle here. Safety Daryl Smith here. to the tournament desk. Daryl Smith to the tournament desk. And he puts him in jail, except that he has the one railer. He has a hit with a bit of pace here. Ready? Ready at the bar. Still looking to play this one in the side. He wanted to break those balls up. <laughs> That's going to put him in trouble. Nestle just looking. This 310 is no good. I'm interested to see how Nestle is going to play this three ball. How about like that, bro? Last night. Yeah, Tommy. Tommy right? Yeah. Yeah. They let me in. Yeah. He told me yesterday. He said I was going to let you in. Good. I'm glad, sir. All right. Okay, let's go back at the table. Fancy position play coming up. Flat. We're going to have to see another fancy position play here. Unless Ernesto's looking to play the 7-10. I don't know. He usually doesn't do anything that's not productive. Just like that. Look at that shot. He's just so solid all around. And Ernesto is... Uh, could ask for a better role model, I'll tell you that. Looking for a love bump. Ernesto's looking to put him under the 10 here. It's a tough shot, I think. <laughs> oh, man. This guy's crafty. Mr. Rojas does have some options here, but either way, he's going to have to execute.
that's not going to do it unless he gets into a now he made it tough but I see Ernesto pop these in like candy Man, that is two that Ernesto just gave away. Man, there we go. Seven six. You must be psychic. Am I? What's up, guys? All right, they're also going to make us in the booth, and Marcelo Rojas, Ernesto just gave him away. Yeah, he missed that nine, and he yeah. slapped it in the other hole. Yeah, yeah, he did. Yeah, he had two. What's the score here? The score is seven six. Pops is up. Pops? Yeah, Pops is up seven five seven three, two games, and he missed one. Seven, gave six. Him ten seven six. Yeah. yeah so, but he was up. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Thanks. You're good. How's this guy playing? This guy plays good, but he don't—he plays bigger, I think. Yeah, he does. I knew it. I knew it. I just could tell by how his demeanor was. He pockets balls and stuff, but like the nine ball or rotation stuff, he doesn't do that well. But cool. I'm just getting a read because this is the guy that beat my dad. A big set for five thousand. Playing what? Ten ball. Nah, pops beats this guy. Yeah, he beat Dad for five thousand. Pops beats this guy. Pops played bad at though. Yeah. And then uh, the same day we played Ruben. He played Ruben and lost another three thousand. We lost eight thousand one day. Mm, yeah, so no. We, oh, look at this. Yeah, I'm telling you, he does stuff like this. He does stuff like this good, but shoot again. I like Pops over this guy. Shoot All right. again. <laughs> there you go. Pops has Pops has a, has his number. Oscar in the tournament, Oscar in the tournament. Alright, alright. Mr. Dominguez. Alright, Marcello with a uh, opportunity here. Mr. Rojas going to the jump queue here. So what a good safety coming up and right to the back of the eight. Drifts right out and gives the guys gives him the edge. He's looking at that four or five. Says if I can thin off this edge, I can put him in jail.
Yep. Goes past with the spin you win. Miss hits it. I don't know, I think we might see a 210 here. Tommy DiLorenzo, Chris Mullen, table 18. Chris and Tommy, table 18. Even race to seven. I think, uh, well, you know, he has a shot here. He has a shot to win. Struck ball. Seven seven. Race to two. I'd like to thank our sponsor, Andy Cloth. You can check him out at andycloth.com. Andy Beard Cloth, a suitable alternative to any of the cloths out there. Ernesto's break here to get on the hill. Peter Yorka and Ray Robles tied at 3-3. Bill Stock and Rick Armburst tied at 2-2. Mandy Yovano and Bobby Evans tied at 3-3. Chris Lolek and Tommy DiLorenzo 2-2. Samson Mayanko, Derek Carvamoda, Samson up 6-5. Dave Martin now up 5-2 on Jose Gonzalez. Eric Young up 8-7 on Joey Barreria. We got a little timeout here. And he comes right back. So here he comes. And, uh, you know, we got 7-7. Seven, seven. Marceau makes a, a long combination, a long 2-9 combination. Drills it. Drills it? Drills it. And he played the cue ball to the end round. So what happened after he hooked himself? Did he kick that ball and hit it? He kicked the ball and hit it. He didn't jump it? No. See, the thing is, we have a game where he wants to play without me jumping. And I'm like, well, he's like, oh, I don't own a jump cue. Well, that's your problem. That guy can't beat you. I don't know. He's a good player. No, he is. But, um... He showed me a lot when he played my dad out in San Diego. He showed me a lot, a lot. I mean, he played some sick... Six shots. Yeah. Finesse. Yeah. He had control. He has that. Except my dad's break is, he's been working on his break recently at home and he's been breaking unreal. Pop's been breaking like a beast today. Is he? Okay. Yes. That, that explains He's been breaking like a beast. Yeah. Like that. That break. Yeah. He's just been hitting them yeah. so pure. Yeah. Just like that. That's what he's been doing. Just hitting them so pure. And, and he's getting, uh, he's getting the second balls flying towards that side. That's what you need. With the turtle rack, I mean, you have to hit them good. Yeah. So you know how it is. I, of course. All right, Raw, what do you see here? I see Pops with the thing to win. He's got a big wall of China here. Hello, nine ball. Oh, <laughs> good lord. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's ten ball in play. All day. Pops oh. Dominguez. Welcome to Alcatraz, buddy. All day. All day. Oz, real quick, what do you think about the Darren Appleton 8-Ball Series? I'm looking forward to it. Um, actually, I might. I got the invite as one of the Americans, but right. I have to check our schedule, see if we have a tour stop that week. I didn't even know. Um, I was going to do it, but I just, honestly, I've been yeah. out of the loop at home. Yeah, I got you. Um, 
it's a good game. I mean, eight ball. I mean, yeah. In the single elimination, I like. Mm-hmm. Um, this guy hits. What a, the balls. What a kick. This yeah. guy kicks. I'm I can tell. I can tell. I watched him. I said, this guy plays billiards. I watched him hit a couple of balls. Kicks really. Never gives a ball in hand. No. But, uh, yeah, it's exciting, you know, because Darren's got the the respect of of so many right. people, and it, it's a good thing because he's got the connections. You know, he's in with That's exactly with right. Star. He's in yeah. with uh, Chikio. He's in with Predator. He's in with some of the biggest sponsors in the industry. Right. Strack and Cloth. I mean, he's got the yeah. in. So it's just a matter of of him Execute. executing it and having. You know, Angie's going to help him. She's she's like Desiree, very uh, oh nice, good, very, you know, hands on. And she's super smart as well and uh, um, I'm excited to see how it progresses mm -hmm. Darren does have the resources right the connections to do something right Technical yeah, right there. Yeah. The work And the soft fills are. Mm -hmm. Fillers mm -hmm. need those. Yeah. Because there's only one spot. Yeah, because there's only one spot. Yeah. Yeah, it's too much money. Yeah, it's too much. Alright, Marcello with a nice spinner here to get to the right side of the seven. He's going to have to execute, though. Tough shot. Big yeah. skid here. Okay. He stays down on the ball, man, though. This guy just, he just, I don't know which of the shots that give him the trouble like the, the nine balls are, but his control game is pretty strong. Just use high outside English. So yeah. Just roll it. You two play cushions. them those two cushions. Yeah. You you play that shot good. I don't like drawing it just because it's too thin of a hit. He moved. Yeah. He, he moved. He moved on it. He made it good though. No, he did. He did. He did it on the thicker side, but he made it good. Right. So we got a uh, hill seven. Hill 7. Like the banner sponsor, Aramith, Dormith, Pro Cup Brawls, and Simone Squad. Check them out. That's the way we roll. Aramith. Yeah. Yeah, so Oscar, yeah, we were talking about that with uh, Darren and the Make It Happen event with Active Stats and stuff like that. A lot of good things going on with Pool, but, uh, buddy, you are soaping uh, the list. Oh, oh man. God. Are you serious right that's, now? That's a true world championship. That's a world championship. Whoever wins that plays in pool. Yeah, that's that's in my <laughs> opinion, that's a true world championships right now. I, um, I'm I'm hoping that you, we get somebody from America up in there. That's gonna be rough. It's gonna be a very, very Wu Cha Ching? Everybody's coming. Chang Jun Lin, Chang Yu Ko? Ko Pini, Ping Chu. They bring in the heat. Um a, I, and and, and the, the Polish guys you were saying too. Oh yeah, Fortunski. I, yeah, I gambled with those guys. Out yeah, there. those guys. I saw that too. Oh, and man, straight so, some more too. Some more. Yeah. If you, if someone, I was looking at the list. Oh man. I, one of the 
players that I'm, I'm actually eager for Americans to see um, is a German kid. His name is Joshua Filler. Right. Uh, not many people know who he is. Uh, I gambled him in Qatar too, and boy, uh, it's kind of uh, it's kind of exciting to see a, a new new style of bowl. Yeah. He's like a Jason Shaw slash uh, Dennis Hatch. And wow. I mean, just so much power in this game, and he's only 18 years old. That's insane. It's it's kind of it's kind of crazy. It's kind of exciting to see uh, what is what he's going to develop into. Right. I mean, obviously, you know, he might get a girlfriend, he might quit pool. Right. Life gets in the way, but he seems very focused. And, yeah. Uh, it seems like he's a good the future of Europe. Yeah. And you got to just, you know. Was this a break and run? Here? Yeah, it might be. Got a nice out rack. Oh, really good out here. Yeah. Out. Stuff like that, though. You just any balls I gotta go rails. He hits some good. Yeah, he's always on the right side of the ball. Yeah. Plays good angles, good patterns. Doesn't force anything really. That was actually a mistake there. Yeah. Ended up a lot sooner than you need to, but considering you got so close to the ball, you can just inch it out. Yeah. Like I said, I mean, he already kind of knows he's got to do a little bit more than what he should have. Right. But, I mean, balls are close. So exactly. It should be okay. Yeah, he's got to like he got to do a lot of work. Yeah, he's got to do something dumb here to not get out. That might be it. Yeah, that's that's something kind of dumb. <laughs> yeah, if he gets this, soft. yeah, he gets But he's, he's got enough to cue. He should be okay. I mean, he's a great player, so he should be okay. Yeah, this guy hits the ball is good. Yeah, good shot. He recovered well. Hmm. Get out. Yeah, it was, man. 